just so you know, most wireless microphones that you see commercially used, matter of fact, everything you see commercially used now is UHF. People still do use some VHF uh, wireless microphones. Those are typically very inexpensive, um, and they're not used uh, by, by Broadway or the broadcast industry, generally because there is just so much other RF out there in the FM band. So a transmitter is a device that converts audio signals into electromagnetic waves, and the receiver is a device that converts the electromagnetic waves into audio signals. These are the two main components that you have in a wireless system. In our microphones, we have lavalier mics, lav mics, handheld <coughs> microphones, and headboard microphones. The receivers can be, again, body pack receivers, referred here to pocket receivers, a rack mount receiver, or they can be portable or an in-ear monitor receiver as well. Different types of antennas that can be used are omnidirectional antennas, ground plane, active, passive, circularly polarized. And the, the lav mics and the headboard mics can have different pickup patterns or polar patterns. You know, that's how the microphone capsule picks up the sound. We're going to go into the differences in the polar patterns in the wired microphone section. But just very briefly, an omni pickup pattern means just what it sounds like. It's omnidirectional. It picks up in a 360 degree pickup pattern. A cardioid microphone picks up in rather a heart-shaped pattern, okay? And that's desirable on a lot of microphones because there's no rear pickup. So if you have a floor monitor, say, in front of you, there's no rear pickup here, so you're less likely to have feedback. 